Jamal! Stop arming Saudi! Someone said that the death of one person is a tragedy. The death of millions is a statistic. Uh, the death of one reporter uh, in a horrible death was a tragedy. But what about the hundreds and thousands of people in, in Yemen who are, who are suffering? They're not just a statistics. They're people, children, men, women, starving, dying because of the actions of the the illegal actions, the criminal actions of the Saudi regime supported by Theresa May and her, uh, her government and her need to make profits for the, the, um, the arms industry. You know, what they've done to Jamal Khashoggi is, is typical of their repression of um, human rights. It was horrifying just how, um, how blatant everything was. I think that says a lot about the state of the world right now. Um, that they didn't even feel that they had to cover their tracks. This is an incredible act of not just barbarism, but very arrogant barbarism. In, in a consulate in a foreign country to do this is quite astonishing. This is a government which we've, all, we've got the latest thing with Khashoggi, but let's remember, a few months ago they kidnapped the Lebanese Prime Minister and held him hostage. Um, they say they allow women to drive, but the women who led that campaign have been put in prison. There is no democracy, there is no freedom, there's no possibility of criticism of the Saudi royal family. It's one of the worst regimes in the world. Is this incident now and what's happening in, in Yemen, like, we have to say, like, enough is enough. And until now, we don't have the actual truth, like the whole truth about what happened to, to the journalist Jamal. Um, so we are asking, we are asking for answers for this, for this matter, like for, for what happened actually. Um, really, it's not surprising that they did this, although it's more barbaric even than I'd expected of them. And of course, it's an outrage what they've done to suppress free speech and to put other journalists off. Um, expressing their views about the Saudi regime because I'm sure that's the purpose of it. Stop arming Saudi! Justice for Jamal! Stop arming Saudi! Justice for Jamal!